<laughs> to be honest, I care about Anomaly more than Cthulhu because I want to have a good 5 gold turn. Yeah, it's not a hero that wants power early game, it's a hero that wants versatility on 5 gold. On 5 gold, you kind of don't want to level, you want to double buy because you go double buy into double buy into price that buffs everybody. Do I think this hero is good? No, but he's good enough. He's better than my, op my other options. Like, what was the other thing I could have picked? It was another hero that had like decent mid game, but weird early, right? Sky Captain Crag was the other hero, right? I, I think Ticketus is slightly better. Uh, let me put the buns, I forgot to put the buns. Quillbore, Murlocs, and Pirates are banned. I still need to get used to Quillbores getting banned. I actually kind of like it a bit better. I've got some fresh recruits for you. Good start. I had 50% to win, right? If he attacked first. Might of Stormwind. And you buy double Sorrelis. Buff them. And now, next time you go and try to buy some more Death Rattles. Looks good. And I get to keep my reroll because I was offered pretty good minions that I was happy buying. win he asks you if you want to play Rat King or Nizov. Oh, uh, Nizov is better if beasts are available. If no beasts, play Rat King. Even if I don't end up keeping the selfless, it buffs way too much right now and it's super good against Katoon. Basically guaranteeing me the victory. And I value that quite a bit. Next turn, I'm not sure if I should level up or sit. That's gonna be like the most difficult decision of the game probably for me. Told you. I mean, we had 0 0.7 to lose. I don't even imagine how we could have lost this. Nice work out there. Spawn is insane. Cycling, Cyclone is insane. I'll buy the ghoul just to buff my guys. And keep my reroll. This is actually sick. Like, right now I feel like I don't need to do anything. And I'm super strong. The 4-4 and the selfless can go. I think it's better to go 3-3 free free first. This way you're gonna have two free freeze. Rather than having a 2-2 two and a 4-4, four four, you have higher chance of them dying and then buffing your whole board. This looks like a really nice game of Ticketus. Next turn 4, turn after 5. And turn after kick W. Efficiently killing the 3-3. Free free. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Six drop. The efficient way to play this is simple. Level up, buy selfless, 
freeze and hold. Next time leveling is 8, you have 10 gold. You start your turn by leveling, you sell him prisoner, play the selfless, buy the second selfless, play it, discover a 6, play the 6. Take W into each rat. That's how you play. And that's how we roll. Very nice, smooth, and efficient. Do you need a tissue? No, but I need to go change my underpants after this game. Just kidding, I don't have any underpants. Just kidding, kidding. Of course I don't. Nisori, I'm back. Okay, we have on the house. So you level as I said, sell, buy, play. I think we might level to six next turn and we can own the house on six. Wolf Amalgadon. Wow, Wolf is really good here. Do I want the house for Byron or do I just want the house on 6? I think we're so strong we should want the house on 6. Going for Byron and Byron only is not optimal, I think. I think we are so freaking strong. We can go to 6, on the house for Wolf or my ex now, and then just roll and try to get Byron, try to triple, try to whatever. I think basically we have the luxury of time. Ardu still has the free roll. Yeah, literally, last game I couldn't know what I wanted from life. This game, I don't need any roll because Bob is just perfectly delivering the absolute top of the line, top of the shelf minions. Imagine rolling, dude. These are the best games, to be honest, when you don't need to roll or barely roll. I need to figure out what to do in those games where I'm rolling in the deep. Double wolf, like this is illegal, dude. Illegal! Triple wolf. Big snake. I want a big snake. I'll keep the cyclone. I don't need the spawns. Okay, chat, chat, chat. I want all of us to do some visualization together. Imagine. You are playing Battleground, okay? Now imagine you got to play Cthune. Last thing I want you to imagine is it's turn 9 and you're facing this board. What is the first thing that crosses your mind? Alt F4. He also won the last fight. I bet he's feeling good about himself. Oh, I've dealt with a league of evil. Terrible people. Tippers. You've got this. You're way ahead. Golden Macau. Okay, Mr. Kutun. Now it's personal. You stole my Macau. Wow, he survives with one health. So lucky, dude. So lucky. I wanted to kill him to put the Macau in the pool. You're good at this. Okay, we're looking for Byron. I like this on uh, when playing beasts. I like this. Baron!
I don't need LF. Does killing somebody actually put the minions back in the pool? It does, but there's like 20 Macaws. Killing that guy puts three more in the pool. It's not gonna change the numbers by that much, but it, it, it does put the minions back in the pool. The pool is more like an ocean. There's a lot of each minions. Like, there's even seven of each six drop, right? So there's a lot of each minion. Technically, everybody in the lobby can play the same comp if they wanted to. Maybe not the same comp with like full goldens, but yeah, there's enough minions for everybody. There's enough fish in the ocean. Meanwhile, in Twitch chat, somebody says double Nomi seems better. Everything yes, I have double Great Wolf, Golden Selfless, Baron, Gas Coiler, and two Soralisks. I should consider switching to Elementals. <laughs> Kappa! This guy also has Macau. Golden. And Dogo. Or did he... Did, he got a Dogo from Sneeze, never mind. Okay, more Macaws in the pool once I realize... <laughs> Had Macau. Correct, correct, we shot, correct. Two turns until the prize. Two turns until the prize and more Macaws in the pool with Katoon dying. Now it's full of Macaws, let's get uh, rolling. Am I actually gonna skip an Amalgadon triple? Am I actually non-sarcastically gonna skip an Amalgadon triple? Yes? Goodbye Amalgadon. Amalgadon tat me. That's what I would have picked. Exactly what you were looking for. The Donger wants me. Oh my god. That's exactly why I don't want him. One adaptation. Plant. Hi, Mr. Streamer. I got 7.4k without perks. That's very good. Congratulations. Everyone's gunning for you. Watch out. Don't you play on Cleave? No. Don't you want Argus? No. I guess I should Argus the Selfless, but you don't want to taunt the Wolf. The Wolf never wants to be taunted. You should be glad you got the bad Amalgadon, saving your luck for the next game. This saving your luck for next game is like super copium mentality. By the way, double uh, Zamzarak, both very low health. Okay, one was dead. You're good at this. Oh, I got prize. Uh, make a random minion in Bob's Tower and Golden. Return a friendly golden, a uh, non golden minion to your hand. Divine Shield, I guess. Divine Shield the Baron since they shot. Why would I Divine Shield Baron out of all my minions? Oh my god. Imagine if I would pick the make a minion golden. My ex now with Divine is good. If I would make Great Wolf Golden, I would have two wolves with the faceless. Two golden wolves. That would have been insane. While you can. That's what I would have picked. Go ahead and hire one of these recruits. I'll make sure these ones stick around for the next time. Yeah, Golden Baron, if I'm not dead here. Can you believe I got Golden Wolf, Golden Baron, Golden Selfless? Didn't see one Macau.
This might be one of my best beast starts I ever played. So you, you have to waste one gold here. Please don't minus one gold me, kick W. Okay. I mean, I don't know. I need Macau. Uh, I don't even know how to do it, dude. I need this to become a second Moaisna, and I need yes. this to become a golden Macau. And that's it. Thank you, Bonferroni, for the 22 months. Voice crack? Yeah, I'm... I'm I'm voice cracking because I have no idea how to play this. You actually don't need anything you can go AFK. Come on. Let's try to win this fair and square. I want to go maximum strength. Oh, I need Hydra as well. I haven't seen one Hydra either, right? I think I would have bought it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you want these to become Maxna, these to become Hydra, these to become Macau. Maxna taunt, selfless taunt. Then you put Macau first, selfless second, or selfless first, Macau second. Selfless first, Macau second. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Now we know what we want from life. And also, like, you don't necessarily need two Maxnas, you can go two Hydras instead. So we need one Hydra and then one Hydra slash Maxna. Thank you, Yagi, for the 17 months. I appreciate it thoroughly. You got this. Thoroughly. More divine shields. JR, thank you for the nine months. Yeah, this fight is taking ages. I almost fell asleep. Okay, it's us against the Ragnaros. Nice work out there. Keep up the pressure. I don't want a second gas coiler. I only want Macau Hydra. Ooh. You're down a minion and up a goal. A good tactical choice. Hydra over 3048. It seems so wrong. Let's buy it and hold it in our hand. <clears throat> I don't want my wolf to potentially get cleaved. You have to put selfless first, because if you don't put selfless first, Macau can trigger on the selfless. And you want Macau to trigger on the wolf exclusively. Let's see if you can stay on top. If he cleaves my selfless and kills Macau, whatever. He has one cleave. How bad can it be? Well, we're gonna see now.
83% for us to win. I feel like with this positioning, I shouldn't lose. I don't want to sell my selfless because selfless is actually pretty valuable. When you have golden wolf and golden baron, golden selfless is better than a beast. This looks bad because my minions are vanilla and they have very low health. But I just need one knockout to proc and we win the game. I attack first, so I always win here. Just watch. Just watch the fight, okay? Watch the fight. And don't tap me, please. Just see how many stats we are gonna get here. <clears throat> it's funny that the brand was exactly big enough to kill my guy. So what was the chance? It was literally 99.8 Like even if he attacked first Like literally the only reason why we lost the last fight is because his cleave killed my Baron Even if his cleave cleaves one of my Macaws, I still am ULTRA GIGA STRONG Beasts are very powerful They are not the best, but they could be if you get enough good minions And if nobody plays beasts and you manage to like hit uh, and find the right composition EASY CLAPS Nice, nice, very nice. First place with Ticketus. Didn't win a game with Ticketus in a long time. Or a game with Beasts. I need to message my editor about this. <laughs>